TV is dumb loud. Hey you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Michelle here and I'm back at it again with another video now if this is your first time ever being on my channel then go ahead and smash that subscribe button if you end up enjoying this video and turn on your notification bell so you can be notified every time every time I upload another video so before we actually get into this video I do want to give you guys time because I'm not rude I'm going to give you some time to truly smash that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because that's the only way you guys are gonna know when I upload a video now you guys so today's video is going to be a little bit different so for today's video I'm just going to be doing an unboxing well not truly an unboxing because y'all already opened it but I'm just gonna be showing you guys Guys, a new purse that I purchased now if you guys don't know a little backstory about me is I don't really purchase purses like it's not really a bit of me but that's because it's never been something that I gravitate towards as a college student like when I was in college like I never felt the need to have you know I don't know it just was never really my thing I don't really like purses as I am getting older I am gonna work on my purse collection okay I'm gonna step it up one day at a time yeah so today's purse is going to be the Marc Jacobs snapshot and this is a purse that I've been eyeing for such a long time so let me just go ahead and show you guys the beauty Y'all, this purse is so cute. Can we get into this purse? So this is the Marc Jacobs snapshot. This is what it looks like. It has two zippers. So at the top it says Marc Jacobs. One zipper going this way and then you have the other zipper going the other way. So this is what it looks like. This is the side. And here is the back where you can go ahead and put your cards um, so inside it has two compartments so it has this top compartment in this compartment I just have my card showing that it's an authentic Marc Jacobs bag and then at the bottom this place is the bigger unit so this is what this inside looks like as you guys can see there's tissue paper um but yeah so this is what the purse looks like and it's so gorgeous i just decided to get it in the all white with silver hardware and then on top of that what i love about this purse is it has these straps that you can go ahead and um change so if you like you could always get a different look for the purse so again this is what the purse looks like now i just want to show you guys um the strap i have and i just have this all white monochromatic um strap and it says mark jacobs the mark jacobs and it's a really thick strap so the reason i decided to go with this purse is because it's a bit of me like i'm very like i don't know i'm not too girly girly but i'm not like very tomboyish so i'm very versatile when it comes to my style um so i do like small dainty things but at the same time i do like things that can be kind of dressed up with like sneakers and my more casual looks so this purse was screaming at me um i've wanted it for a while now and i just didn't know what color i really wanted to settle on when it came to this purse so happy i chose the white um one so i believe this snapshot retails for 325 dollars um and just depending on the colorways it can go up or down i think the more colorful colorways may be cheaper if you want this one or like the all black monochromatic look like you know the more um timeless colors it is going to be more expensive so here is this one um i 
I love it y'all I'm so happy I didn't know whether or not I really wanted to get it I didn't know if Marc Jacobs was still considered like a designer I mean I guess it is not the top top one but it's still considered a designer this is great quality it keeps its shape really well just really really nice and sturdy they do have other sizes of the snapshot um, so they have the snapshot DTM they have the snap uh, I think the soft snap um, which is a bigger size and then they just have a couple of other sizes but this size is perfect it's not too small and it's not too big like I said I'm more of a small purse gal unless I'm going somewhere where I would need a big purse but on a day-to-day -day, this is a bit of me I would yeah I'll just close to get the black one but I did want to get the black one because I wanted to do something different and I just have black purses I don't have a white purse or a cream purse or anything like that and I really liked this one what I love about their straps is it can be switched out like I said so I'm definitely gonna get more straps from like the Marc Jacobs website where you can switch out different straps so I'll include some pictures of different straps that you can do that can give the purse totally a different look so we love that um, I love that for us y'all mm, I love it you guys so I actually didn't get this from the Marc Jacobs website um, it actually sold out in this specific color so I had to buy it off of a girl on Mercury which is like one of those websites where you can sell your stuff like it's basically like Poshmark pretty much uh, and even with that I was really excited because I was able to also talk down the price which is really great so instead of me paying three hundred and twenty five dollars I was able to get it for two hundred dollars but she was actually selling it for two forty five and then I just talked it down to two hundred dollars you know Nija girl and me I'm not playing those games I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it down a notch okay so overall I'm just really really pleased with this purse so I just actually want to show you guys how I fit some things in here and some things that I can fit in this purse so you can get an idea of what can fit in my bag so kind of like a what's in my bag I'll go ahead and I'll put my phone in here first I need to take out obviously I need to take out um the tissue yeah um so i'll go ahead and first i'll put my phone i'm gonna put it in the first compartment in the front so my phone fit i mean i could always fit a couple of more things in there um so i might just put some lip gloss i don't want to put too much stuff in here because we ain't trying to have this purse lose its shape although i don't really think it is because it's a very like sturdy leather so i closed that and then i'm just gonna fit more things in here okay you guys so in my bigger everyday purse i have this crown royal bag i know a little ghetto okay it's a little it's a little you know it's a little a bougetto but um i have this and this has my spending nice stuff so um stuff that you would just need like your essentials so first i'll just go ahead and put my um card holder in my bag now i'm just gonna start stuffing things in the back just to see how much we can fit in here then I have my gum so I'll go ahead and I'll put that in here then we have our classy hand sanitizer I got this from work so I'll go ahead and I'll put that in here we have mask off mask off okay so I'll go ahead and put that in here um, and we're kind of getting full you know I think I can only fit one more thing and I think it's a day. It's a wrap. A couple of things that I would like to put in there is just like some chapstick, which I think I can definitely still put that in the front without messing with the shape of the purse. And then I don't think I can fit this. No, that's a force. Um, these are just my wet wipes, like my feminine wet wipes. But definitely don't think I can fit those so it's a force at this point we're almost bulging so that's not ideal for me um, I think low-key it's the hand sanitizer so I don't know if I want to keep that in here or I would use a less bulky one. So now I can close my purse this is what it looks like it's not bulging really sides look fine and the side looks fine yeah so this is what this purse looks like um, again with the strap I really like the thick strap 
and it's adjustable which I think is super cute so you could wear it as low as you want or you could wear it as high as you want just want to come on here and show you guys my new purse I think it's cute it's giving me so much life i'm really really pleased with this purchase um so if you're thinking about getting the mark jacobs snapshot definitely go ahead and get it i'm gonna show you guys the other color i was this close to getting y'all i was this close to getting the olive green if you know me you know i love me some green like it's a bit of me so i was so close to getting the green but i didn't do it so yeah i'll insert a picture of the green one so y'all can see but yeah all right you guys so that's it for this video if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below what you thought about it um, comment down below if you like Marc Jacob purses or if you have any another one that I really liked was um, like the box bag so like the lunchbox type of bag this is more of like a camera bag and it is just so cute again i'm very very pleased with my purchase but yeah i'll see you guys in my next video don't forget to tell your mama your auntie your brother your brother's girlfriend and your grandma to join my family and i'll see y'all in my next video much love bye y'all